Yeah. Yeah. Can the Harlem nigga talk his shit on this or nah? Need no man. Black. I told y'all I'm hungry for success, but y'all don't hear me though. Yeah. Heard that I'm getting black ball because they fear me yeah. though. That's why I keep a small circle like a cherry, yo. Yeah. All killing them, pockets fat like Terry, yo. Cop the Jaguar for my moms and the material. Yeah. Scared money don't make money and they scary though. Niggas keep thinking shit a game, but look Larry though. Fuck around, have you ducking shells like Mario. Boom. Good wings, good pizza, good soda. My YouTube video. I look like casting over with this gel, gel status thermal. Yeah, girl, you know you fucking with a shot, huh? Come in, let me give you to your problem. I'm from Flatbush, you know the Gaza. I don't know the rest of that song. Hey, bitch, I got the motherfucking lemon pepper. Lemon pepper, what's up? <laughs> Fresh new shipment, you feel me? We got the lemon pepper staffers. Custom made. We had sent our slippers out and we had got them customly painted on, you feel me? And they sent us the lemon pepper staffers. Okay, I want to try to. Oh, I got the snapback because my hair is not um, shaped up. So, like this video if you ever got something to drink, which this is my weekly water i don't do gallons every day no i ain't that healthy and i just started this to the head i didn't get to give y'all a video last week and if you see this fit hmm 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 you already know no no where i came from where i came from where i where I, where i came from where i came from where i came from this video is going to be on this video is on, you feel me? If y'all if y'all didn't catch it by the thumbnail, or y'all didn't catch it by y'all pose right here, didn't know what this video was about. This video is about the glove, the glove word, the glove word. Bang, boom, bang, boom, bang, boom, bang, boom, bang, boom, boom. This video is straight about the whole boxing situation. Now, I didn't have my camera, so I couldn't record a video at the time as soon as this hat came out but I got my camera now and we're gonna talk about it bro we're gonna talk about it ladies and gentlemen what Nate Robinson did horrible horrible for his side horrible for the community you know what people gotta stop doing when y'all start boxing y'all gotta stop saying we doing this for this that and the third because then y'all make us look bad I did this for the hood y'all know I beat that boy y'all know I beat that boy like Y'all making us look bad. And I feel sorry for his kids and him and his kids. Like, that was bad, bro. Virtual learning, it's over. Don't, you know, my ma he is on every social media tweet. He can no longer open his phone. He can no longer watch YouTube. Come on, bro. He's probably in ads. Is that it was bad because Nate Robinson now gave more opportunities to Jake Paul. People who didn't know of him, now know of him. Which is, I don't have nothing against Jake Paul this whole video. I have nothing against him. Really smart man, really marketed himself. Went crazy, like from YouTube. This goes to the whole YouTube community. Like he made this big, like now this is a topic. With Corona, nobody being able to go out, nobody to vlog. It killed a lot of things for a lot of YouTubers. But now, Ding ding, we got something to talk about now. And now more YouTubers can step in this field. You just you just opened their doors, which was good on Jake Paul part. It's a lot of positive, but right now I'ma just get to the negatives on Nate Robinson and what could have been. Not to try to put him down, but just to explain to people what's going on. So Jake Paul now gets to, I don't know if it's going to happen, I don't know if it will stop, whatever, but Jake Paul now gets to box Floyd Mayweather. There's millions of people who have to climb their way to the top of the ladder. There's millions of people who have to go fight to fight to fight just to fight Floyd Mayweather. 
If he wanted to fight somebody that clout, that certification, he could have did it with Gervonta Davis. He could have did it with Adrian Broner. But Adrian Broner, he denied time after time and just kept it on the, yo, nah. And then look what happened to Adrian Broner. Boom, boom, got knocked out. Your legacy is killed now. Now he get no longer, it, it, he got knocked off the ladder. It's over. He's knocked off the ladder. There's a lot of other boxers who would love that opportunity to say they stood in the same ring and fought with Mayweather. It's a win-win situation either way for Jake Paul. It's historical. Great, great marketing, my man. But if it was me in the fight, whoa, 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 no holding, no holding. Whoa, 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 whoa. I would have trained different, me personally. From that whole fight, all I seen was Nate Robinson never stepped foot in a ring and when i say he never stepped foot in the ring if you fight school fights on fridays if you fight family if you fight if you spar period in the ring there's no way he should have went out the way he went out that all they do is train <laughs> yeah it look good yeah oh put your shoulders into it block your face bring your arms back bah, bah, bah. bring your punches back ha ha it looked good. It looked good on camera. All that. And sometimes the, the dudes who be training you be hitting your hands with the stick. So you don't have to have accuracy. They just straight. <laughs> it sound good. As soon as they throw the punch, the coach go. Bow, bow. They're not looking at what they have to hit. Which is somebody's face. Where Jake Paul went good is he spars. <laughs> Jake Paul, he spars. He actually gets in that ring with people and see how it feel to get hit. This is a big difference. Taking that hit, this boom, that, that's a big difference because you could be training for months, training for weeks, and they hit you with that little whoosh, over the head, but you just whop and get under it. Ha, ha, ha. Whop. That's not how it's going to be. That's not how it's going to be. It's all types of punches. There's wild punches. Wah, wah. There's straight punches, zoom, zoom, zoom. There's punches, bop, bop, and movers. Punches, bop, bop, and movers. And once you throw that punch, that boom, boom, and that move a move, even if they miss, just know, beep, beep, something coming after it. So, Nate Robinson, what he did was, my man sat there with his hands up like that. If Jake Paul is in the... I'm sure if Nate Robinson had him in the corner from his training, he would have did the same thing. But taking those hits are different. So when he had him in the corner like that, this is a Jake Paul punch. Don't mean to promote. This is now the Jake Paul combo. Three-piece Jake Paul combination. My man's hit him. Eh. Straight jab. Eh. And a hook. My man's hit him with the like, comment, subscribe, and that was it. One more time, my man's hit him with the like, comment, subscribe, and he backed up with what I just, whoop, whoop. You got some people who, who back up. You got some Mayweather slip off the head. You got some Tysons. Ha, 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 ha. Nobody really don't know damn punch how they be throwing them little batons. Smack, smack, baton. Smack, smack, baton. No, people gonna throw combos. Wop, wop, wop. Or some people be like, all right, get in the gym. Box, 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 box. And then they get in the ring and throw some completely other shit. Some. How is one, two, duck gonna help you? Listen, bro. It's different to get hit. And once you get hit. It's a whole nother ball game. Jake Paul combo. Ready? Like, comment, subscribe. Oh! 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 It's different when you get in that ring. When you get in that ring, it all get real. This throw a nigga whole game off. Ah, they hit you. Bow, bow. They hit you. Throw a nigga whole game off. Ready? Bow. That one hit that make your ear ring. That turn your whole life around is just like. One, two, three. Oh. 
that didn't happen in a gym. But, oh shit, like, that boom, that blurry eye like you just woke up in the morning, and you, and you thinking, damn, my dignity, let me keep it together. No, you, that's called getting hit by a force of five pounds or more. Depending on the workout. Hey, don't let him get his legs set with the turn. Don't let them do that because now full energy blow. Boom. Viral movie. My full camera had that. I had to get the second um the second battery. But yeah. Y'all feel me? Y'all remember the punch? Y'all remember the punch? Uh, uh, like, comment, subscribe. Yeah. Yeah, do that. Another thing Nate Robinson messed up with is he backed up into the corner, onto the ropes. That is the boxer's dream. Because at this point, I could hit you with the Mac, Mac, Mac. And then when I'm done, I could just lean on you. You can't go nowhere. There's nowhere you, can, you can't back up. They could hit you, push you into the corner, but still hit you. Because you're going to bounce off the ropes. Or they can just grab you because you're only going to be in one place. So now they know where you at. They no longer have to worry about you jumping sideways. They don't have to worry about you jumping back, coming back. They don't have to worry. They, there's no, you, you, you clipped off to your angles. There's nothing much you could do. If it was me, this would have been me. We stupid weed. Come here. Weed. Everywhere. Weed, weed, weed. We stupid weed. We. What was they teaching them in training camp? I don't know. Slip. Boom, boom. Slip, slip. But I thought Nate Robinson was going to win for the simple fact of how he's an athlete. Athletes train different. Normal people, they shoot 25 shots, couple dribbles, shoot, they good. Athletes, on the other hand, when they fighting or playing for a dream, they know how it is to actually try to make it to something to where their parents are crying, something they work for so hard that they're in that gym shooting 200 shots and they not leave until they make 200 shots. They going above and beyond for the playoffs in the gym extra. They oh, how'd you get here? How'd y'all make it to the playoffs? Well, me and my guys, we had cut off playing around time. We stopped going to the clubs. Uh, we, uh, we, Man, even some of us stop seeing our wives at some point just to keep that uh, stamina and adrenaline rushing. But we made it to the playoffs. We're glad to be here. Thank you. Like, bro, it's they they got that training mentality. A YouTuber is, hey, boom, bam, I'm here for the money. I'm here for the fun. Yeah, road trips, boom. Six Flags, boom. Bouncy house, boom. Skies on, boom. Like, it's, it's all YouTube is, hey, fun. I'm going to be an actor. Let me do something that y'all going to laugh at. Like, it's, they don't really know. I mean, they know. We all human beings. We all know. But they don't know compared to an athlete that trains for something. So, in my eye, and from my thoughts, I thought Nate Robinson was going to win. Nate Robinson was being a outside fighter. If I could throw this piece in the beginning, Nate Robinson was being a outside fighter. My son came straight to the fight. A couple punches and hit the skip to my loo. He said, Woo woo, woo woo. How athletic Nate Robinson. This nigga just did the Super Mario hop step mixed with the Air Jordan logo jump. When I see Nate Robinson training, he had a ball in a tire and he was throwing punches. Let the ball go, catch the ball. Throw the ball go, catch the ball. Let the ball go, catch the ball. In a circle, which means you're practicing to be a a one place fighter so let that fight come to you let it come to you you're an inside fighter you're a uh, uh, block you're a ribs ribs face back up uh, uh, uh. wait for the perfect opportunity or you a Roy Jones Roy, did you see Roy Roy was what Doing his thing, doing his thing. You know, he knew he wasn't no outside fighter. He wasn't going to chase Tyson down whole fight. You crazy? He could have died out there. Real talk. But anyway, like even you don't have to be inside with it. You could be here with it, like like Roy. Like you could be here with it. Wow, wow, move, wow, bang, 
move, you could boom, boom, move, V, all that. Like, like, why did he run? And you the shorter opponent. You don't run. All Jake gotta do is this. Step back, here, jab, and hold it out. You're gonna run into the punch. Wow. Wow, you gonna run into the punch because he's taller than you. It's harder to fight taller people. And yeah, you was fighting an outsider's fight. You were supposed to be fighting an insider's fight. And keep it moving, mess with his head, hair, hair, throw your shoulders a little bit, wop, wop, fake a punch, uh, wop, wop, bang. You know, something, something. You were supposed to give us something. Oh, by the way, the video that I'm showing was a play fight. From what I thought, I didn't know that we really was like, Bow until I felt the little bow in the bow and I'm like, oh, ho, ho, let me get out of here. We. So, when y'all see that fight, according to this fight, I lost. But, if y'all want to see the whole fight, get this to 400 views, and I'll let y'all view it, and I'll let y'all tell me what y'all think. You got to be able to move, Nate, Nate. You're so small. All you had to do was, hit, and then boom. You ain't even had to go all the way here with it. You ain't had to go here with it. Like, Nate, you're so short. You should have been training with Roy Jones. You should have been on Roy Jones' side, training with Roy, while Jake Paul was on Tyson's side and doing his stuff, Dizzle. Now, for other upcoming people, other upcoming YouTubers that I see, I ain't going to say no names, no nothing. Make sure you get in that ring and spar. Because if you don't get in that ring, if you this is what makes a good fighter. Possibly, possibly, and if I'm right, comment please. Fighting after school every Friday, you know, you get into the fights. Oh, man, 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 you learn what not to do and what to do next time. Then you get into your third fight at school, they know you begin beat up. Yeah, yeah, ha, yeah, yeah, ha, ha, yeah. Yeah, now, this is where you mess up again. Yeah, yeah, what's up? What's up? Wow, wow. Now they grab you. Wow, they got you, right? Boom. You trying to lift them up. They trying to lift you up. They Boom. Somebody get thrown on the floor. You know what that person learns from then? Don't let them get close to me. Bop, bop. Don't let them get close to me. Bop, bop. Oh, he grabbed me. He grabbed me. Stomach, stomach. Uh, uh, me. They going crazy. They going, because they know. They know what happened last time. Wow. Or... Or, this is what else makes a good fighter. Fighting with family. You got that one little cousin that everybody was picking on. Now cousin about nine feet tall. Everybody looking at that little cousin like, oh yeah, he was getting punished when he was younger. And now he's not playing no games. He or she is not playing no games. Everybody used to throw him across the room. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And you know what they got now? They older, now they planting their feet. Bop, bop, yeah. Push me. Play with me if you want. Boom. You like, oh. 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 Lil Ray Ray just threw John across the room. Yeah. Yeah. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. <sighs> Coming with the family fights. Matt, Matt, Matt. Somebody get serious. Bow. Oh. Now everybody looking like this was started too. Oh. Ooh. I wouldn't let that happen to me if I was you. I wouldn't let that happen to me if I You gonna let him do that? You gonna let her do that? Now it gets serious. Me, my, my, and they going crazy. Now they going crazy. Now they, now they really get, but you know what that makes? I'm better fighter.
YouTubers take this time to get in your limelight because this could possibly be your, you feel? Like, comment, and subscribe while I'm on this cam. Smith underscore Giddy, follow me on the gram. This another like banger going into the fans. I was just bullshitting. And you know this, man. Yo, rich nigga, I'm a real right killer. Keep the flames on me like my name is Godzilla. I'm a to kill him. I've been walking with gorillas, nigga. We a real zoo. This ain't fun and instrumental. All my niggas shooters, all my niggas really do this. Rolling with the Ruger just in case I gotta pull it.